Hey, one Voltard forever here, doing a little update here. You know, I watched that Class 1A game, and I kind of ignored the top side of the bracket, and I shouldn't have. Uh, I kind of thought Cornersville had a chance, but they did. They only lost by one point, but what a game. Uh, you know, they both beat unbeaten teams, and, you know, Whitwell beat uh, last year's champ, Greenback, who had beaten Cornersville. But uh, what a contrast in teams they had, though. You know, Whitwell was physically a lot bigger. But, uh, you know, the win played a factor in the game. And, but Cornersville's defense uh, was really good at stretching plays out. If you all missed it, uh, it was an outstanding game. Uh, just really good to watch if you like defense. Um, I don't know how much big-time talent was on the field, but it doesn't matter. Uh, those kids got out there, played hard, and uh, they got memories, you know, good and bad for the rest of their life. But what a game. They just – both teams played really well. Uh, Cornersville, you know, down the stretch had a little clock management problem. Maybe they could have had another play if they'd have done that a little differently. But uh, just a really great team. You know, Cornersville was uh, – had a lot of team speed. Whitwell was really big up front. I think they – had Cornersville in the interior by, you know, 30 or 40 pounds a man anyway. Uh, but I really enjoyed that game. Uh, obviously, a lot of other people did too because they had more crowd there than of the other games so far. I know Alcoa and Covington's uh, fixing to kick off here in about uh, 25 minutes, it looks like. But uh, I'll probably watch some of that SEC championship game too. Boy, it'd be nice if the balls were in there. I don't know who's going to win the SEC championship. I'd say Alabama has a chance to uh, – if either of the teams is going to jump out there and make it a blowout, it'll be Alabama blowing Georgia out. But I, I don't know. We'll see. I know Alabama's got a lot of good targets out there. If Tua stays healthy, they're probably going to beat Georgia. And that'll be really fun because uh, – <laughs> We'll get to watch Uncle Lou break stuff. <laughs>